a histogram is a type of graph that shows how numerical data is distributed. It is the graphical representation of group data with continuous classes. In a histogram, each class in the data is represented with a vertical rectangular bar. The width of the bar represents the class interval, which is placed on the x-axis, while the height of each bar represents the frequency of the class, which is on the y-axis. So let's look at the continuous distribution of the age in months of children who attended the immunization clinic in Samaru Zaria in October 2025. This data can be represented in a histogram by placing the classes or age groups on the x-axis and representing each class using a rectangular bar whose height is the corresponding frequency on the y-axis. So the first class of 0 to 5 months will be represented as a rectangular bar with a height of 2 units since the frequency is 2, right? For the group of 5 to 10 months, that's a frequency of 5, so we'll draw the height to be 5 points. And for the 10 to 15 months, that's 8 points. And so we'll draw it this way and so on. Unlike a bar graph, there are no gaps between two consecutive rectangles because histograms are drawn from numerical data in the form of frequency distributions of a continuous series. So it has to be continuous without gaps. All right, this is the quickest description of a histogram. Now, if you want to see a complete video that covers everything you need to know about histograms, then check out this video here. And for a complete guide to bar graphs, check out this other video right here. Like, share, and subscribe if you found this video useful. And as always, thanks for watching.